Hello and welcome to another MicronMapper team video. Today I will show you how to properly process MicronMapper data in ExoCAD. Once prescription in ExoCAD is appropriately filled, we can proceed to the design stage. Now the project requires data to be loaded. Uh, look at the top line for the description of the appropriate mesh to be imported. First, we would import the jaw scan, which in this case happens to be a rural scan, and then the scan marker scan, which would be micron mapper output. As you can see, the alignment is not quite right, but this can be easily fixed through the expert mode. First off, set the scan data orientation such that the red on the intraoral scan is not visible and hit next. We will then switch gears and load the expert mode. In tools, select add remove mesh, and the mesh type that needs to be realigned is the scan marker scan. We then need to manually position both meshes such that it would be convenient to set a few corresponding points, and it may be a little tricky at the first sight. Press align meshes afterwards and select a few corresponding points on micron mapper output and intraoral scan. Press perform alignment and best fit match right afterwards. And then you can see the gradient that indicates deviation scale. But now there is some overlapping between the two meshes. And to fix that, just uh, right click on the model and select edit mesh. And now you can cut all of the unnecessary data away and do some fine adjustments on the model as you wish. I recommend cutting all of the floating parts away as they may cause some issues afterwards in merging stage. After this is done, hit OK and then going back to wizard, you can proceed with designing a restoration with a micromapper library. And as you can see now, the alignment between the scan flag and the actual scan is perfect. 